There's no place for argument. Hallelujah. 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 Oh, Rara Satara Rara Rara. Oh, Commander Pasataya. Yes, it is Rara 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 Papa Maya. Hundred Kishia Araba Hasata. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. 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 Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, family. Hallelujah. Good morning. Uh, Dre and Faye, good morning, son and daughter, hallelujah, welcome, good morning, Lind- uh, Pastor Linda, Pastor Telly, good morning, hallelujah, greeting, 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 greeting to you in the mighty name of Jesus, oh, shatika, blessings, blessings, good morning, good morning, good morning, puyai and tips, hallelujah, hallelujah, greeting in the mighty name of Jesus. What a wonderful day, hallelujah. What a, what, a, what a day to be alive, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Yeah. Family, this morning, you know, as, uh, as we are waiting for the others to arrive before I share the word of God, please use your, uh, use your hand or use your thumb to, uh, to be a blessing this morning, hallelujah. Blessing Pastor Sakun, hallelujah. Blessing Faith, blessing Billy, hallelujah. Good morning, hallelujah. Welcome, 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 welcome. Greeting to you in the mighty name of Jesus, hallelujah. Hallelujah. What a beautiful name, the name of Jesus. What a wonderful name is the name of Jesus, hallelujah. So this morning, wherever you are watching from, hallelujah. Wherever you are connecting from, hallelujah, I just want to greet you in the mighty name of Jesus. I just want to say shalom, salofa, hallelujah. You are blessed in the mighty name of Jesus, hallelujah. Oh, shatarararara, brada, baba. Oh, kotaya, mende kashuya, apaha. Hallelujah. Let us just spend a moment or two is just worship hallelujah worship god this morning hallelujah oh then i'm about by using from beginning to the end for argument you are god all by yourself you are god from beginning to O Shara Prahasata O Kotoya Mandi Prasaya O Korosate Tataya Yes, share this broadcast, hallelujah. Share this broadcast this morning, hallelujah, to be a blessing to someone. Hallelujah, hallelujah. We are in these last days, we are in these seasons, hallelujah, where the Bible says heaven and earth will pass away. Reputation will fade away. Your muscles will go away. Hallelujah. Your money will, 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 will fade away. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Your houses. Hallelujah. Your nice cars. Everything. Hallelujah. But the Bible says that my word will remain. Hallelujah. But we know in the, in the last days, in the darkest hours of our time. Hallelujah. In darkest hours. Hallelujah. We can face the only thing that can take you across is the word. The only thing that can, can save you is the word of God. The only thing that can stand for you is the word of God. Oh, Rahanda Mashenda Akatia. Kesepra Kotamaya Kete. Yerarashanda. Okoropa Hasataya. Your mother in law will not stand for you. Hallelujah. The word will stand for you. Hallelujah. Your friends will run away from you when darkest hours arrive. But the word of God will stand for you. Kumanda Pasetakaya. Hoshotaya. Ederarababaha. Okosonda Masia Iasataha. Oh, Okoropa Handa. So blessings, greeting to you, families and friends, this morning. Wherever 
wherever you are watching from, share, share this uh, broadcast, hallelujah, share this live, hallelujah, to be a blessing to someone else, hallelujah, that today is going to be a day of salvation for someone, but you can be a point of contact, we can be a point of contact for salvation, today is, today can be a day of blessings, today can be a day that someone's life will be saved, today can be a day of uh, you know, someone's life will be preserved, hallelujah. But you and I can can be a point of context, hallelujah, by sharing this alive, hallelujah, sharing this uh, this podcast this morning, podcast this morning. I believe, I believe the word of God will bless someone this morning. Gurra setaka matea yaha. Oh, should you rap a handa mala sadara bahasite? Oh, kotoya karapa hasata. Yes, Lord, we thank you. Father, we thank you. We thank you for this new day. Lord, we thank you for each and everyone, hallelujah, who is connecting this morning, hallelujah, who is watching your servant this morning live on this live, Lord God. Father, I pray, Lord God, that they that their times and their seasons, Lord God, will be changed, hallelujah, from glory to glory, hallelujah, this morning as we as we share the word of God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Go shapranda mare setakaya sarara. Hallelujah. Mm -hmm. oh, share this life, share this life, family and friends. Hallelujah. From beginning to there's no place for argument. You are God of yourself. Oh, Kurosa Tarara. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. You know, family, we are, we are living in these days that everything is changing, hallelujah. Everything is changing, hallelujah. Government is changing, people is changing. Sometimes, hallelujah, people that were so nice to you and all of a sudden they change towards you, hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Sometimes, you know, your boss at work, all of the sudden change, all of the sudden, hallelujah. But we, but one thing we know, that God never changed. He's the same God that raised Jesus from the dead. He's the same God that, that you and I serve today. He's the same God that brought Israel out of Egypt. He's the same God that will give you new seasons. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. This morning, this morning, share this uh, life, share this word of encouragement to be a blessing to someone. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, Jesus. Oh, Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh, Kurama Handa. Rasi Tikite. Oh, Hallelujah, Hallelujah. Let us spend, let us spend a few moments just to pray in the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. Let us just pray. Hallelujah. As you are praying for yourself, you are also praying for someone else this morning. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh, Roro Rararararha, Eke Tepra Hatapaya, O Roro Sunde Yahati Alabaraba. Heavenly Father, we thank you for this wonderful opportunity. Heavenly Father, we thank you for the gift of life that you have given to us. Heavenly Father, we thank you, the Lord God, that, uh, that we have been placed on this earth for a purpose. And Father, we thank you, Lord God. That, uh, that, that today is a new day. We thank you, Lord God, that today is a day of salvation. Father, this morning, Lord God, as I go live on this platform, Lord God, Father, is, if anyone watching me, if anyone uh, hearing the sound of my voice this morning, Lord God, who is going through sickness right now, Lord God, or their loved one is going through sickness, Lord God, Father, with this virus that is going around, Lord God, Father, I declare your healing in the mighty name of Jesus. I declare your restoration in the mighty name of Jesus. I declare freedom in the, might, in the mighty name of Jesus. That, uh, that, that the power 
of the blood is, 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 is far greater than any virus. The power of the blood can destroy any virus. And Father, this morning, Lord God, whoever is, is watching or hearing the sound of my voice, may be going through struggle in life, may be going through in tough times, Lord God. Father, today is the end. Hallelujah. Today is the end of struggle, Lord God. Father, because we know that the God that we serve is a God of new beginning, is a God of new season, is a God of life, is a God of hope. Hallelujah. And Father, we thank you, Lord God. Father, I pray, Lord God, for, 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 for everyone on this platform, Lord God. Father, as they are praying for someone else, Lord God, Lord, that you will double their blessings in the mighty name of Jesus. And Father, we thank you, Lord God. Father, anyone who's, who is connecting to us right now, Lord God, that that doesn't know you Jesus that hasn't uh, tasted the goodness of you Jesus Father I pray Lord God the Holy Spirit the Holy Spirit you will minister to their hearts that by the end of this broadcast Lord God Father that they have made a decisions for you Lord God Lord God we thank you Lord God Father we give you praise and we give you glory this morning Lord you are so good you are so good you are so faithful hallelujah Hallelujah, hallelujah, in the mighty name of Jesus, amen, amen, amen. What family, yeah, good morning to you, hallelujah, it's uh, Pastor Levy here uh, from Melbourne Light of Our Nation, the city of opportunity, hallelujah. You know, we, we, we use every opportunity, your life is an opportunity, everything to do with life is opportunity, hallelujah. You know, many times we go, we are after the grace. But if we don't take opportunity to receive grace, we will, we still, we will still remain cross. But today, as you hear the voice, the sound of my voice, hallelujah, may, may this opportunity become your opportunity, hallelujah. May this day become your day of good news, hallelujah. As we are in the month of good news, hallelujah, may this day become your day hallelujah so i just want to uh uh greeting to you in the mighty name of jesus hallelujah to, uh, to every man of god hallelujah to every pastors or every 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 man of god hallelujah from around the world hallelujah every christians or every 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 anyone who's connecting to us this morning hallelujah through this life yeah Greeting to you in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. It's a beautiful day here in uh, Melbourne right now. Even though we are, even, you know, this is something. Even though we are in, we are in lockdown, but the sun is still shining. There is something that, that, that governments cannot stop. They can stop us from going, going over five miles, five, ke kilom five kilometers, hallelujah. But they can never stop the sun from shining, hallelujah. So this morning, if you are watching me and, you, and, the, sun, and the sun is not quite shining in your, <laughs> in your area, in your life, in your, in your health, in your finance, hallelujah. May today be the day that the light will shine on you in our mighty name of Jesus, hallelujah. Hallelujah. But, uh, but please, family, share this live. Hallelujah. Share this live. I believe it's going to be a word, hallelujah, for someone this morning. I believe it's going to be a word to encourage us this morning. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yeah. So uh, I just want to, uh, uh, you know, uh, greet, to say hello, to uh, uh, welcome all our pastors on this platform. Hallelujah. I see Pastor Vanu. Hallelujah. Welcome, sir. Pastor Sekun. Hallelujah from the city of Well, Hallelujah, Pastor Vanu from Hallelujah City of Possibility. Hallelujah, welcome, pastors, Pastor uh, Tele. Hallelujah from the city of Grace. Hallelujah, welcome, 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 and all the pastors. Hallelujah, Hallelujah on uh, on this platform. Yeah, Fatalo Fatu Leswafa Man Malo Yesu Kiriso. You know, greeting to you all in the mighty name of Jesus, and also never forget, Hallelujah, our 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 spiritual father hallelujah my father in the lord hallelujah peter and mary hallelujah greeting to you papa hallelujah may the lord bless you hallelujah thank you for everything that you do for us thank you for praying for us here in melbourne hallelujah we are seeing we are seeing the light shining hallelujah and we know that this lockdown is coming to an end hallelujah hallelujah 
But uh, my family, yeah, this is uh, Light of a Nation from Melbourne. Hallelujah. If you, uh, if you have been praying for us, I just want to say thank you. Hallelujah. You know, we are the champions of uh, the most locked down city in the world. <laughs> so sad, eh? But we thank God. Because why? Because even though we are locked down, but people are still testifying. People are still blessed. Hallelujah. Because why? Because we know we don't pay attention to the lockdown, but we pay attention to the God of heaven and earth. Hallelujah. So this morning, yeah. Welcome family. Welcome and greeting to you in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. So this morning, you know, uh, I just want to come and uh, bring a word of encouragement to, to you Hallelujah. And to all of us this morning. Because the Bible says, you know, in Hebrew 10, 25, where, 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 where the Bible says that never neglect, hallelujah, the coming together. Hallelujah. And, and then the, that verse says that encourage one another. Hallelujah. You know, we are living in this season so that we're, we, we're supposed to encourage one another. Hallelujah. But, uh, but, we do more discouragement than encouragement. Hallelujah. But that's other churches. Hallelujah. But we are the light. Hallelujah. We encourage one another. Hallelujah. So this morning, if you are joining us this morning, if you are feeling a little bit discouraged, hallelujah, say thank you, Lord, that today is my day. That by the end of this life, you will be encouraged. Hallelujah. By the end of this life, hallelujah, the word of God will encourage you. Not my word. Hey. My word is the worst this encouragement. My word does not encourage you. Hallelujah. But, but the word of God through his servant will encourage you. Hallelujah. So don't look at the servant. Look at the word. Pay attention to the word. I am just a messenger. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah. I know, I know, I know, I know some of you already fika pastor. Hallelujah. Some of you are hallelujah already. Hallelujah. All is well. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. What did Kula Epa says? I forgive you. Hallelujah. <laughs> but may the Lord bless you. The Bible says in the book of Ecclesiastes. Ecclesiastes uh, chapter 3 verse 1 and this is one of the, 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 the chapter that we love we hear hallelujah many of many times we hear this chapter hallelujah in funeral hallelujah in, in special occasions hallelujah but I just want to bring this chapter uh, uh, some verses or may, just one verse hallelujah uh, from this chapter to encourage us this morning Verse 1, I just want to use verse 1, hallelujah. The Bible says, there is a time for everything and a season for every activity under the earth. Hallelujah. I love that, where I say seasons for every activity under the earth. That tells us there is no seasons in heaven. We only have seasons down here. So therefore, we make, we make use of the seasons before we go to heaven. Because why? There is no seasons in heaven. Hallelujah. He says here, a seasons for every activity under the heavens. Hallelujah. But the Bible says there is time for everything. This morning, I just want to encourage us about the value of time and season. Hallelujah. Time and seasons are very important in our lives, family. Hallelujah. <laughs> you know, time and seasons are very important in our lives. Hallelujah. You know, that's why, that's why, you know, that's why when you, when you wake up in the morning and you know your alarm didn't go as you wanted so that you can get to work on time. Hallelujah. You ended up speed on the road and you get a ticket. Hallelujah. And then you ended up blaming the devil. Hallelujah. Because why? Because of time. Hallelujah. But this morning, you know, this morning, I just want to encourage us about the value of time and season in our lives. Because why? Because when we go to heaven, time is not value anymore. Seasons won't be value anymore. 
But here we are, we are on this earth, that this is a time for us to use our time wisely, to, to step into every season that, uh, that God has set for you and for me. Hallelujah. You know, there are many times we tend to value times more than seasons. Hallelujah. But you know, if we don't approach, if we don't leave, or if we don't work our seasons accordingly, hallelujah, then we lose the value of time by wasting time. Amen. Because here, he's something family. There is no seasons without time. And also, it is, time, it is seasons that add value to time. Hallelujah. I'll say that again. There is no seasons without time. And it is seasons that add value to your time. Hallelujah. You know, you know, I used to live in, in, uh, in Hawke's Bay, Hastings, New Zealand, where, you know, where it's one of the area that is well known in, uh, you know, in, in picking fruits. Hallelujah. And everyone that lives in Hawke's Bay, they know seasons for each harvest. And what does that tell us? Hallelujah. It is, there is no, it is seasons that gives birth to harvest. Hallelujah. But I thank God. Hallelujah. Because you know, this weekend is a weekend of new seasons. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I am excited because why? This weekend, hallelujah, the, our, con, our global conference, a new season conference, hallelujah, it's going to be a weekend for you. It's going to be a weekend for your family. It's going to be a weekend for your finance. It's going to be a weekend for your health. Hallelujah. Because why? Every new season shall manifest to harvest. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. As I said before, family, there, there, there is no seasons without time. And that's why, that's why you and I, we know that time is one of the greatest, greatest gifts we can have in this life. Okay, let me go deeper. Time is one of the greatest gifts we can give to God. Hallelujah. <laughs> Hallelujah. You know, we time is very important. And that's that's why you know sometimes you 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 come from work, hallelujah. You come from work, you need time to yourself, hallelujah. You need time to uh, you need some you need some private time to yourself, hallelujah. Because why? Time it is very important in our lives. And, uh, and we are living in these seasons where the enemy, hallelujah, the enemy is, 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 is wanting us, hallelujah, to misuse our time, hallelujah. The enemy is wanting us, hallelujah, to throw away the value of time, hallelujah. And that's why, you know, family, you know, when, 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 whenever we say that God is not looking for ability, God is looking for availability. God is looking for, God is wanting you to make time for him. Hallelujah. God is wanting us to make, God is wanting us to make time to spend with him. Hallelujah. Because why? You know, ability, God can give you the ability anytime through his grace. Hallelujah. But God cannot make you available unless you make yourself available. Hallelujah. And that's why, you know, time is one of the best gifts we can give to God, family. And that's why, you know, when we are in these seasons where, where God says, hallelujah, hey, son, spend time in my presence. Come and spend time in prayer. Hallelujah. God will not make time for you. You, will have, you and I will have to make time for God. Hallelujah. But this is the thing. If we don't make our if we don't make time for God, the enemy will abuse our time. Hallelujah. The enemy will abuse our time. By what? Netflix, hallelujah. Movies, hallelujah. TikTok, hallelujah. Facebook, hallelujah. 
I see some people already repenting. That's good. Hallelujah. The grace is working. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I uh, hallelujah. Looking forward to see some people tonight on, on our online prayer meeting. Hallelujah. Thank God the grace is working. Hallelujah. You know, it's important that, uh, that, that you and I, we make use of our time wisely. Because why? There is value in time. And that's why, you know, that verse says, there is a time for everything. Hallelujah. When, the, when, that, when that time is over, you might not get that time again. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. But, uh, but you know, as, as I shared this morning, the value of time and seasons. Hallelujah. Maybe, maybe you, are, you are here this morning and you say, Pastor Levy, I am a, such a busy person. I don't have time for God. I don't have time to pray. I don't have time, hallelujah. I don't have time to, to, to come to church on Sunday, hallelujah. Do you have time to eat? Yes, of course you do have time to eat, hallelujah. Yes, God will never make time for you and for me, hallelujah. We have to make time. And when we do that, God will, God will add value to your time, hallelujah, hallelujah. And we know that, uh, that every season is for harvest. Every season is for harvest. You know, uh, as I said, I used to live in Hawks Bay. And, and when, the, when it's apple seasons, everyone's language, hey, this is the apple seasons. When it's the bear seasons, everyone speaks the same language. This is the seasons for bear, hallelujah. When it's a season for asparagus, hallelujah, everyone speak the language, this is the season for asparagus. When, when, when there is a season for strawberry, everyone know this is the season for strawberry, hallelujah. And we know that every season there is a harvest that is expected, hallelujah, hallelujah. Praise the Lord. And we know, you know, family, you know, this morning, every season has a finished date. Like right now, we are heading towards summer. Hallelujah. The summer season has a finished date. <laughs> Hallelujah. And we know that when, when it comes to the end of any season, it's the beginning of a new season. Hallelujah. When it comes to the, to the end of any season, it's a beginning of a new season. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I don't know family. I don't know friends what you are facing in these seasons of time. I don't know what you are going through in these seasons of life. Hallelujah. But one thing, I, well, one good news I can give to you. Hallelujah. Your seasons that you are going through right now is not permanent. Hallelujah. Your season that you are going through right now, it has an expiry date. Your season that you are going through right now, hallelujah, it has a finished date. Hallelujah. So therefore, when you go through that seasons, hallelujah, hallelujah, according to Galatians 6 verse 9, hallelujah, don't give up. Don't give up. Keep going because their seasons will come to an end. Hallelujah. But we, it's best, it's better. You know, it's, it's important for us that we will, that we keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Hallelujah. Because why? Because you don't make decisions. You don't make seasons. We, I don't make seasons. Only God makes seasons. Hallelujah. And when he placed you in a season, hallelujah. Oh, but when God placed you in a new season, oh, God will also give you a, a harvest, hallelujah. God will also give you a expectation of harvest, hallelujah. So this morning, whatever season you are going through, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Don't, don't throw away your hope and your trust in God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You just stand firm and you say to yourself, even though in my seasons, hallelujah, it's not good. Hallelujah. But I put my trust in God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Because why? You know, the Bible says that one day in the Lord is what? It's like a thousand. In other words, what makes what takes us thousands, days or thousand years to, to get, God can give it to you in one day. 
So therefore, you know, family, whatever seasons you're going through, I'm speaking from experience, hallelujah, hallelujah, because there were times, hallelujah, seasons I went through, hallelujah, seasons I went through, I was about to give up, I was about to throw in the tower, hallelujah, I was about to throw in the tower, hallelujah, especially when you go through seasons, when people say that to you that you are not good, when people tell you that there is no way out, when people tell you that your God is not, is not, is not, is not answered your prayers when you go through seasons where you pray and nothing comes huh? when you pray and nothing happens hallelujah don't give up family and friends don't give up keep going keep going Be keep going hallelujah hallelujah because why god is a uh, omnipotent god is a sovereign god hallelujah you know all these times that peter hallelujah uh, peter was was with jesus hallelujah but what does the Bible say? One day he preached, 3,000 people came to the Lord. Hallelujah. So therefore, you know, family, whatever seasons you are in, please don't give up. Hallelujah. Don't give up. We cannot change seasons. Can you, can you show me your hands if you change uh, uh, seasons to swap summer and winter? <laughs> You know, we cannot change seasons, but we can learn how to approach. We can learn how to live. We can learn how to work in seasons. Amen. There are blessings in every season. Hallelujah. There are blessings in every season, family. And maybe if you, if you, maybe you're, maybe you're, 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 you're saying to uh, yourself, Pastor Levy, my season was not a good season. Hallelujah. Every season, there is blessings in every season. Hallelujah. But not every season get harvested. There are blessings in every season. Because why? The Bible says that out of darkness, I will pull out. Hallelujah. Prosperity. Out of darkness, God command the light hallelujah <clears throat> so therefore you know every season whether it's dark seasons or down seasons or the, <laughs> or or bad seasons hallelujah it will always be a blessing hallelujah because why because you know the god that we serve it is the god of the mountain it is the god of the valley hallelujah it is the god of the light hallelujah it is the god that can take you out of darkness hallelujah so if your seasons is dark hallelujah god will shine the light into your seasons hallelujah there are blessings in every seasons but not every season gets harvested hallelujah because why because in every seasons hallelujah hallelujah in every seasons there is a harvest but we know there is no harvest without a seed Hallelujah. Many people, they want to receive the harvest. The harvest. <laughs> it's all right. I'm speaking like my father. English is my fifth language. Hallelujah. Every, 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 every season, there is a harvest expected. But there is no harvest without a seed. And I believe that's why, that's why our seasons, hallelujah, our seasons don't, don't, don't get harvested as time, as time. Because why? Because we are too busy after the harvest, but we are not paying attention to what, what we need to do with the seed. Hallelujah. If we are too busy trying to receive the harvest of, uh, you know, of appreciation, of, of loving, hallelujah, of forgiveness, hallelujah, but we are not sowing the seed of forgiveness. We are not sowing the seed of love. We are not sowing the seed of appreciation others hallelujah hallelujah but today is a new day hallelujah because why because God is about to place you into a new season hallelujah God is about to open a new season hallelujah God is, is about to to place you into a new season hallelujah where that new seasons will will, will, will will manifest its harvest hallelujah to the glory of God hallelujah family Hallelujah, Lord. Maybe your current seasons is not going well. Hallelujah. Maybe, maybe the seasons that you're in is is not is not what is is giving is giving you the opposite of what you are expecting. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. 
or, or it's not giving you what you were hoping for. Hallelujah. But, uh, but this morning, family, hallelujah, this morning I want to encourage you, I want to invite you, hallelujah, that, that this weekend, hallelujah, this weekend, we, uh, um, as a light of all nations, global conference this weekend, uh, a, a new season, hallelujah. I believe, I believe, I believe this is, this is a word, hallelujah. This is a season for, for us in these days that we are in, hallelujah. So I encourage you, family, that, uh, that, that uh, you know, bring friends, hallelujah. Invite your families and friends. Invite your families and friends, hallelujah. You know, you know the season you are in. I don't know the season you are in, hallelujah. But if the season you are in is now giving you satisfaction, hallelujah, maybe it's time for new seasons, hallelujah. You know, the, this weekend is going to be a weekend that we cannot afford to miss, hallelujah. It's a weekend of uh, a new seasons, hallelujah. This will be a beginning of a new seasons for you and your family, hallelujah. A seasons of healing, a seasons of prosperity, a seasons of finance, hallelujah. A seasons of resurrection, hallelujah. A seasons of restoration, hallelujah. A seasons of freedom. A seasons of victory, hallelujah. A seasons of good news. Oh, I love that. A seasons of good news. Oh, shut up at here. Hallelujah. But you know, family, in uh, 1 Peter 5, verse 6, hallelujah. I love this, hallelujah. Because the Bible says, humble yourselves, therefore, under, the, under God's mighty hand, that he may lift you up in due time. Hallelujah. Maybe this morning, your seasons, hallelujah, your past seasons or your current seasons has been such a humbling experience for you, hallelujah. But you know, you know family, that is good because why? Because when you and I know how to humble, we will also know how to hold ourselves together in glorious times when God lifts us up. Hallelujah. When you and I know how to humble, hallelujah, in bad seasons, in, 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 in dry seasons, hallelujah, stay humble, hallelujah, hallelujah. Let's see, hallelujah. If that season, your current season is not happening for you, hallelujah, stay humble because why? The Bible says that He may lift you up, hallelujah. So when we know how to stay humble, hallelujah, we will also know how to hold ourselves together in glorious time when God lifts us up. Hallelujah. And that is the new season I'm talking about, family. That is the new season. Hallelujah. You know, according to uh, Isaiah 43, hallelujah, where, where the Bible says, See, I am doing a new thing. Hallelujah. But I love the verse before that verse, hallelujah, verse, verse 18, where it says, forget the former things, hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. You know, sometimes, sometimes we want, we want new things, but we are still holding us to former things, hallelujah. Sometimes we want, we want to step into a new seasons, but we are still living in the old seasons, hallelujah. Sometimes we, we want to, we want to concentrate on the new seasons that we are about to step into, but our mindset is still in the old seasons, hallelujah. But today, hallelujah, today in the name of the Lord, hallelujah, I am here to bring a good news to you, hallelujah, that when God places you into a new season, hallelujah, it's very important for you and for me, hallelujah, to let go of the old seasons, hallelujah, because why? The new seasons will come with its own harvest. Hallelujah. The new seasons will come with its own, with its own blessings. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And you know, family, this weekend, one of the key for this weekend, hallelujah, uh, the, 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 the weekend of uh, uh, new seasons conference, hallelujah, is expectations. There is no, because why? The, we, we want to see the manifestations, hallelujah. We want to see the harvest, hallelujah. But there is no manifestations without expectations. 
So this, this weekend, hallelujah, as we enter into a new season, expect harvest, hallelujah. Expect two good news, hallelujah. Expect something, expect a new thing from God, hallelujah. Because God can never give you an old thing in, in the new seasons, hallelujah. God will give you something new in the new seasons, hallelujah. hallelujah. Because why? Because God is a God of new things. So this morning, family, hallelujah. This morning, you know, when God bless you and me into a new season, expect that he will also do a new thing in your life. Your family, your health, and your finance, hallelujah. God can never, God, God is a God of new things. When he bless you into a new season, he will also he will also do a new thing. Hallelujah. Expectation, family. Hallelujah. And this morning, today, hallelujah. If your season is not seasoning, then it's time for a new season. Hallelujah. Let me say that again. If your season is not seasoning, hallelujah, then it's time for a new season. Hallelujah. 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 If your season is not seasoning, it is time for new seasons. Hallelujah. So in closing family this morning, you know, I just want to, uh, I just want to remind us, hallelujah, that time and seasons is so important in our lives. Hallelujah. Because why? Because time add values. Hallelujah. It is time, it is, it is, it is times that, that enable us to harvest seasons hallelujah it is times that, that enable us hallelujah to to uh, to to seek the throne of grace hallelujah because why you know before we receive the harvest we need to make time to ourselves we need to make time for god we come together to pray we come to hallelujah we come together encourage one another hallelujah so this morning, family, hallelujah, in closing, this weekend, hallelujah, hallelujah, I just want to uh, submit to you, hallelujah, this special invitation, hallelujah, this weekend, hallelujah, as a light of all nations, uh, global, we will be holding a conference from Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. And this conference is new season, hallelujah. And I know I'm looking forward to it, hallelujah, because why? Hallelujah. I think this is a this is a this is a conference for Melbourne. Hallelujah. Because we've been in this seasons of lockdown for so for so long. But we we, we are ready to receive. Hallelujah. We are ready to step into a new season with expectation. Expectation of souls, expectations of prosperity, expectations of opportunity, expectations of finance. Hallelujah. Because why? Because God is a God of new seasons hallelujah so this this weekend hallelujah my my beloved hallelujah spirit of father apostle of fire the prophet of god peter and mary will be the host hallelujah he will be hosting the conference uh, this weekend hallelujah and and uh, and and what 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 makes this conference uh, special is going to be a double double hallelujah two prophets hallelujah to uh, to release the word for you and for me hallelujah who who wants to miss the opportunity hallelujah and our guest speaker hallelujah is is my spiritual grandfather hallelujah prophet richard amoya anointed man of god hallelujah he will be bringing the word to encourage and to build us up hallelujah he will bring in the word hallelujah for to plant us in this new seasons that we are about to step into hallelujah hallelujah prophet uh, richard amoya will bring in the word hallelujah so that you and i can plant well in the seasons we are about to walk, to go into hallelujah so so this conference will be live on, on Facebook and Zoom, hallelujah. But uh, if you want to know more uh, information, uh, look, at, look, uh, look us up on uh, uh, lightofornation.com, hallelujah, for more information, hallelujah. But today, I just want to thank you, family. I just want to uh, leave you with this thought, hallelujah. Never, never misuse our time. Never think lightly of seasons, hallelujah. Because if we, if we misuse our time, then the devil will abuse our time. 
if we think lightly of seasons, then we then we are not ready for harvest. Hallelujah. If we think lightly of seasons, then we are not have, we are not ready for harvest. Hallelujah. If we misuse our time, the devil will abuse our time. That's what is happening now. Hallelujah. You know, there are times there are hey, even though I'm a pastor, the enemy also try and tell me, don't pray. You pray too much. <laughs> Don't pray, it's time to sleep, hallelujah, hallelujah, but I thank God, hallelujah, for the anointing, hallelujah, that we are under, hallelujah, the anointing to pray, hallelujah, because why family? This is why it's so important that, uh, that I want to encourage us in prayer, because we are living in these darkest hours. We see that everything is dark around, hallelujah, we see that everything is dark in our community, in our government. But, but you know the Bible says the darkest hours of Jesus before he went to the cross. The scriptures never said that Jesus was, was sitting down and read the scroll. Hallelujah. Jesus was sitting down and eat. Hallelujah. Jesus was sleeping. Hallelujah. But the Bible says that Jesus was praying. In this season, hallelujah, in this season of darkest hour that we, are, that, that we are living, hallelujah. As my father says, this is, we are in the lastest days, hallelujah, hallelujah. It is time for us to pray, family, hallelujah. God, so we, something, something happened there. When Jesus came from prayer, he found the disciples sleeping, hallelujah. The church is sleeping, hallelujah. Hallelujah. But you know, I believe that I believe God doesn't want us to sleep. Hallelujah. Spiritually. Hallelujah. But you know, as God said to, uh, to Moses, my presence will be with you. My presence is with you and I will give you rest. Hallelujah. You know, I believe. Hallelujah. We are in, a, we are in this darkest seasons or darkest hours that we need to pray and be rest in the presence of God. Don't sleep in the presence of God. Be rest in the sleep in the presence of the Lord. Hallelujah. So I believe, I hope you are encouraged this morning family. I hope you, the word of God has uh, uh, encouraged you this morning. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I I pray, I pray, I pray that uh, whatever seasons that you're facing, it's coming to an end. Hallelujah. And uh, whatever seasons that you are in, hallelujah, God is about to elevate you into a greater season. God is about to elevate you into a new season. God is about to place you into a new season where, where the harvest is far bigger than your, than you. Where the harvest, Lord God, hallelujah, where the harvest is not what you imagine, hallelujah, but it's for the glory of God, hallelujah. So this morning, you know, before I, before I leave this platform, hallelujah, I just want to, uh, honor the Holy Spirit acknowledge the presence and the anointing of the Holy Spirit hallelujah because it was him that gave the word it was him that anointed me with the word hallelujah and if it wasn't for the Holy Spirit and his presence we can never do anything hallelujah so we acknowledge we honor I just want to thank the Holy Spirit hallelujah for the anointing to share this good news with you this morning and also I want to thank Hallelujah, my spiritual father, hallelujah, Apostle Peter and Mary, Papa, I thank you, hallelujah, thank you for giving me this platform, giving me this opportunity to share the good news, thank you for your prayers, hallelujah, thank you for your prayers, not only for me, hallelujah, as your son, but also for, 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 for Light of All Nation, Melbourne, hallelujah, as I, as I said earlier on, that we hold the trophy of being the longest city to lock down. Hallelujah. But we thank God because that trophy will turn into a trophy of glory for more souls to be one for Jesus. Hallelujah. For more souls to be one for the kingdom of Jesus. And Father, we thank you for today. Lord God, we honor you today. We thank you for your word. I pray, Holy Spirit, that you will minister to every heart. I pray, Holy Spirit, that you will touch every heart this morning, whoever is watching me or whoever is going to be watching this with this live, Lord God, Holy Spirit, that you will use this live as a word of hope, as a word of life, as a word of encouragement to bring life to someone. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Family, this morning, maybe you are, maybe you are watching me this morning and you haven't given your life to Jesus. Hallelujah. You know, it's not too late. It's not too late. 
In fact, Jesus is waiting for you. Jesus know that this moment is your moment. Hallelujah. Don't let go of this moment because this is your divine moment with Jesus. Hallelujah. If that is you watching me on this platform right now, hallelujah. Repeat this prayer. Hallelujah. Simple prayer. Hallelujah. Simple prayer of salvation. But that will open the hands of Jesus. Hallelujah. For you and for your family. Lord Jesus. I thank you that you died on the cross for my place. Today, I surrender my life to you. Today, I ask you to be my Lord and my Savior. Today is a day of salvation for myself. Lord Jesus, I thank you. Holy Spirit, help me. Help me to live for Jesus. Help me to value my time. Help me to pay attention to my seasons so that I can live for the glory of God. And I thank you, Lord. I thank you, Holy Spirit, in Jesus' name. Amen. If that is you, pray that prayer this morning. Welcome to the family of God. Welcome to the, to the, to the kingdom of God. Jesus loves you. And Jesus uh, Jesus, Jesus, Jesus will never look beyond where you came from. Jesus, look at you right now as a son, as a daughter of the Almighty God. Hallelujah. So in closing, family, thank you so much for praying. Hallelujah. Thank you so much for connecting. Hallelujah. Please share this live. Hallelujah. To be a blessing to someone else. Hallelujah. But look forward to see you this weekend. Look forward to, uh, uh, to receive. Look forward to step into a new season with you this weekend so that, uh, so that you and I can receive the harvest of souls. You and I can receive the harvest of finance. You and I can receive the harvest that is far bigger than us. And, and we just want to thank you, family. Thank you for uh, connecting. Thank you for um, watching uh, uh, me this morning. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord be with you. May the, may, may the Lord shine on you. And thank you so much. Hallelujah. Have a blessed day. And shalom, shalom. I love you all, but Jesus loves you more. You are blessed.